this Lion Vision update brought to you by CBNS Bank. We're talking with UNA head football coach Chris Willis. And coach, it's hot out. You guys are continuing the daily grind of camp. Just how have things been going despite the heat and kind of the conditions the guys are working in? Well, you know, it, it, like you said, it's a grind, and it's, it's fall camp, and, um, you know, we abide by the NCAA rules on what they give us on the amount of meeting time and practice time. You only go once. Uh, it wasn't long ago we used to go two times a day. and. Uh, so we we take advantage of um, you know mornings as well as nights. We went a we had a tough little start of the week. We went at night because of that Monday temp, and you know once again I'm sharing a field with soccer, so we have to work together. Uh, so we went Monday night, and it felt like a two a day because we turned right around, we came back like at 9:30 in the morning. So that was a little rough patch right there, uh, and and you know it was tough. It was hot. We had a couple body cramps, but uh, I just remember in back in the day it was two body cramps a day uh, on average. And we've only had two the whole camp. So uh, we, we're taking care of them, and we make sure, you know, between Josh Penny and his staff, we hydrate them like we're supposed to. And it's like, a, you know, once again, it's fall camp. We're just getting after it. Coach, let's talk about some of the upcoming events this weekend, the second scrimmage of fall camp. What do you want to see from some of the position groups? Well, you know, last scrimmage we went about 65 to 70 plays, I believe it was, and uh, it was kind of get your feet wet, run some of the stuff we put in, in, in the, inside the stadium, uh, you know, watching the DBs cover from uh, the full-length field, receivers try to break tackles. And so this one here, we're going to amp it up to about 85, 90 plays, trying to see, you know, looking at durability, looking at, you know, can you fight when you're tired a little bit? Who can we count on? Uh, it's not about trying to get anybody in shape. We feel like we're in shape at this point. It's just who can mentally fight through a 85-90 play scrimmage. I know it's going to be hot even though the temps will be down compared to these last couple days. But uh, you know, and I also want to walk away. I mean, it's it's a big scrimmage and it's probably the last real full out scrimmage. We may have some short scrimmages throughout the week coming but, um, past that, excuse me. But I also want to get off the field healthy. And uh, we need everybody when we open up on that Thursday night. Also, a few other events coming up this weekend. I believe you guys will be out at Hometown Market one of the days, greeting fans, and then Fan Day on Sunday. So how nice is it for some of the guys to kind of get a break from practice and get out there with some of the loyal UNA fans? Yeah, after the scrimmage, we'll have about 10 players, 11 players out at Hometown Market uh, doing an autograph deal, and then we'll turn around on Sunday for Fan Day. I think it's from 1 to 3 at the softball complex. And we'll break up by positions. You'll see some offense and defense in the first hour and, and some in the second hour, along with our other sports, basketball, baseball, soccer. Everybody else will be there as well. So it'll be a fun deal. It was last year. I remember it was a, a neat little deal, and the players like that. You know, it makes them feel very important uh, and that the fans appreciate what they, you know, the time and the hard work they put in. So, Coach, thank you very much for the time. Thank you, Ben.